So as we heard earlier from Iran, navigating traffic and avoiding accidents is of course the key to safe driving. But there are other challenging aspects of driving as well. For example, if you've ever been to Tel Aviv, or any busy city for that matter, you know that finding a parking spot can be next to impossible. And you can drive around for hours and hours looking and it can ruin the rest of your day, not to mention make you late. Well, our next Israeli innovators have the answer to that problem too. Please welcome the CEO of City Transformer, Asaf Formosa, and Chief Innovation Officer, Udi Meridor. Hi guys. Hi. Hi Sam, hope we aren't late. You know how easy it is uh, to find parking in I the know, city. I know, it's very hard, especially around this area, but I know you found a parking spot right over by your booth. Yeah, how, uh, how often do you get stressed looking for parking, Sam? Every single time I drive and have to find a spot, I'm like driving like a mad person looking and stressed. So actually me too. I'm late, I lose lots of time, and sometimes my whole day is ruined. That's why we decided to do something about it. So what's unique about City Transformer? So first of all, we invented a car that can shrink, okay? <laughs> it can shrink to a motorcycle size, meaning you drive it as a car, and when you arrive, you arrive and park it as a motorcycle. So first of all, this is what's unique about City Transformer. And I think there's a video that they're going to show us that shows basically the wheels, I think, come in. Yeah, we will take a look. What you will going to see, all of you, that all four wheels get the same angle. And if it's two people, right? You're sitting in the front, there's a seat behind yeah. you. Tandem sitting position. We have also uh, uh, cabins for one uh, adult and two children. But all four wheels get the same angle. You will see it uh, soon. Facing each other, the car moves slowly forwards, and then it's shrink to a motorcycle size, meaning you can park it anywhere. The cabin stay fixed. So you gain also the uh, safety and the convenience of a car with the benefits of driving a motorcycle. It's also a huge benefit for municipalities, as four city transformer can fit into one parking spot. Four of them in one traditional parking spot. Exactly, so saving up to 75% of space. Unbelievable, and but I know Udi, you want It's much more that. than this, because it's not just a shrinking car. We have also interesting technologies from Israel, from smart Israeli startups, that we are going to embed in our car, which is a head-up display, a huge one, a nice and neat user experience system, and a lot of other surprises that we will be saving for later. And of course, future autonomous system will be embedded. Right, which we're going to talk about in a little yes, bit. Yes, but every city, and it's important, every city transformer vehicle worldwide can be shared through an app. How does that work? So the minute that you purchase a city transformer, you become a part from our community, which is community that committed to sustainability. And once you, let's say you want to drive, uh, travel to Paris. Great, like Paris. Okay, so the first thing you do is probably plan. Come up, come up, come up. So, Don't be afraid, they're really nice. <laughs> okay. So the first thing you do is probably want to plan your trip and then you go into our app and then say, I'm going to be in Paris from these days to these dates. Uh, that's the thing you do. And then if something, someone from Paris that already purchased a city transformer can offer you his car in, during this time and he will earn credit for it. And you will probably do the same with your car back in the States and earn credit for it. The second alternative, just rent your car for non-community members and earn money for it. So you can swap it out, you can rent, you can rent yours all over wherever you go. Exactly. So how did you guys come up with this idea? A few years ago, I went to meet a friend in Tel Aviv. And if you know Tel Aviv, there is no chance of finding parking in Tel Aviv. So I circled the block for 30 minutes and then I parked so far away, so I had to walk another 30 minutes. And I believe in New York, in LA, it's even worse. Yeah, we've all been there. So when I arrived, my friend was complaining about losing an hour a day, every day, looking for parking. Then I knew we should do something about it. So what did you decide to do? After uh, wasting an hour on uh, parking, I needed a beer. Of course. So we went for a beer. And uh, maybe thanks to the beer, because after a few beers, we came with a crazy idea to but fold the car. We got indoors drinking and driving, just for the record. <laughs> yeah. So after a few beers, we came with a crazy idea to fold the car. And then we had so many so ideas fold to fold it, yeah? But then we had so many ideas, but none were feasible until we understood that the cabin has to be fixed, while the wheelbase needs to shrink 
uh, in order to fit anywhere, even into an elevator. Last year, we drove it into an elevator at the Rabin Center in order to present it in the second floor. And here as well, to get it to your parking spot over by your exactly. booth. Exactly. You can go, all of you, later on and see it at our booth. So who is the team that makes up City Transformer? Our team combined physicists, mechanical engineers, and car designers with an experience of working together on building cars, for me, the best team, with national as well as international knowledge, experience, Worth mentioning Professor Tom Forde, the father of the smart Mercedes-Benz city car. It's a good person to have on your team. For sure. So my husband and I are car shopping right now, for real. That's not just a line to like, make this sound better. And I already told him that this is going at the top of the list because I test drove the car yesterday, and he knows how crabby I get when we can't find a parking spot. So it's going up to the top. So can we get one in the States? For sure, you can get one. All of you can get one. You, can, you need just to go and pre-order our car. Uh, by the end of the year, we will have the first pilot of few cars running in Tel Aviv. Uh, we are offering pre-order, and we gain lots of traction all over the world, but mainly in Europe, and I'm proud to say also here in the States. So, depend on the pre-orders, we will choose the cities to go for, uh, for a bigger pilot of hundreds of cars prior to mass production, and for that we are looking to raise uh, capital and collaboration. Great. So, Udi, Iran was talking before about the future of transportation. How do you guys view the future of transportation? So, did you know, Sam, that there are over 750 million parking spaces all across the U.S.? Hello? 750 million parking yes. spaces it's in the United huge, States. It's a huge, huge waste of space. That's insane. It's amazing. Uh, it could be converted to green parks, to community centers, even to real estate. It doesn't make any sense. So I personally believe that the future of personal transportation should be sustainable, meaning it should be small, electric, and autonomous. Being autonomous is not enough. Without being small, it's not enough for cities. Uh, and you, if you can take city transformer, for example, so we consume one quarter of the size of a regular car, one fifth of the energy cost and maintenance cost, it's fully electric and it's autonomous ready. Now, let's imagine New York City for a minute. So in New York City, you have 1.5 million cars. Let's just switch for a minute 3% out of them for a city shared mobility. You can save up to 300,000 parking spaces in New York City alone. Unbelievable. And you can eliminate or reduce pollution dramatically. Yeah. So it's way more than about just a small car and finding a better parking spot. It actually has the potential to make a difference. Exactly. At 90% of the time, there is just one person in the car. It's the driver. So City Transformer will fit perfectly also to autonomous stage, where, where it will be spread optimally and also will be affordable to everyone. With us, people are reclaiming the, uh, the time. Mm -hmm. They can we'll actually, yeah, you can actually drive from A to B and park and B without worrying of losing time on parking. So. Great. No worries about parking, just worry about what will you do with another extra hour a day. I think we can come up with some things. For sure. So, as we mentioned, the City Transformer car is in the village. You guys can go and check it out. Udi and Asaf, thank you so much for being here with us. Thank you, Sam. Thank you very much. You and you are more than welcome to come and meet our team to pre-order and, of course, to enjoy a demo. Great. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you.